everyone welcome welcome back to my channel so today in this video i'm gonna be doing the currently inked for the month of november 2023 so as you can see here i already have so many inks i have my ink journal i have the one when i do the swaps i have all the fountain pens that i selected for this month some water i have my kakimori the pen to do the swatch and then some of this paper in here let's just turn on a candle for today this is the candle this is the forest fear and this smell amazing it just smell like trees you guys know that's my favorite smell that is mainly like pine tree and cedar and sage those are my favorite smells but anyways if you don't know me my name is being i made so many videos about stationery a lot of fountain pens inks plannings unboxings and everything related with that but anyways, without further ado, let's just start. So let me just show you the fountain pens that I select for this month of November. I have it in this cover in here. It's a beautiful cover by the Coffee Monsters Co. And I like it because the emojis are really small. So you can barely see them. You have to see like really close to be able to see the faces. Otherwise, it just looks like a really cute uh, blue cover in here. So I selected this six fountain pens in here let's start one by one i guess you are the first since it came out already so this one in here is a jing hao pen i got this in the mail yesterday and i really love it and actually this is a sneak peek uh, for some of the december mini boxes because on instagram i was doing a little mini box gifts giveaway kind of thing so i selected five people from the united states to send them a little gift and in that gift i included some of these fountain pens because i saw them they were in a set of three and i absolutely love it they are so small so cute so this one as i mentioned is a jinghao mini inside it has this converter that is really tiny so i'm just gonna be using this one for this month i love it and kind of match my nails today so it looks really cute so moving on into the next one this is another Jing Hao that I got. This one in here is a clear one and it just having here some kind of gold. As you can see, just say Jing Hao in there. I really like it. It looks really pretty. It looks so aesthetic. And inside, let me just open it for you guys. So inside here, it also have another one of these converters. So you can actually use it to put the ink in there. So I love it. I'm gonna be able to see the ink. So that's the second one i'm gonna be using then the third one is this one this one already has some ink inside this one i bought it on a detach on instagram otherwise i would not pay as much as this cost but this one is a pilot vanishing point and this one as you can see in here is the decimal one so it already has some blank ink inside so it's just like that so you just push it and push it down so i'm using that one to take notes for school that one has ink inside then moving on into the next one this one you guys have seen it before this has become one of my favorite pens it's so so pretty and also writes so good i use this to take a lot of notes as well this one in here is the sailor i don't remember exactly which brand but this is a sailor it's white with this rose gold in here so when you open it up it's like this it has black ink inside and it does have the one that it comes with so it came with this as you can see it's almost done because i have been using it a lot but whenever i finish i'm just gonna put some more black ink inside i really like that one and i also really like the black ink that came with this pen so this is the for one that i'm gonna use for this month and this one also has some ink then let's move on into the last two so this one in here, you guys have seen it. I did a whole unboxing for this one. This is the Kaweco Student. And this one is so pretty. This one is like a vintage orange in here. It has this gold color that I absolutely love. And then inside this one, let me just open it. It actually has not a converter, but it has this. And it has a tiny little bit of ink left and this ink in here i already forgot which one is the one that i put inside but i have it in my journal so that's what i'm gonna be using it has some ink so i'm just gonna keep that ink in there so we already have three that has ink and three that doesn't have ink this one in here is new i actually just have the box in here and i'm so so grateful because this one my husband gave it to me this is another kaweko student and this one in here is in this beautiful green you guys know that 
this year I have been into kind of oranges, kind of like browns, greens, and all of that. And I love how these two <laughs> looks together. I love it. So this is the green version of the student. This one in here doesn't have any ink. So as you can see in here, it's really similar. It has gold. And then when you open it up in here, this one just come with this. This is not a convert. Oh, it actually has this blue ink. I may actually use the blue ink this time. Let's, let's just try to decide whether or not I want to put in this cartridge in here any ink or if I want to use the blue. I think I'm going to like put some ink in there to be honest, but let's just decide whether or not when we are doing this video. So these are the contenders for the month of November. And I don't know if you guys have seen it, but I already posted a short of all my fountain pens. In that one, I didn't include this one or this one or this one. But yeah, that one was 76 of my fountain pens. And I show you guys in that small short all the fountain pens that I have. But these are the ones for November. So now let's start with adding some ink and selecting some of the ink for these ones. So let's just close this in here and open up this one. I'm gonna select the inks in this video. I don't even know which ones I'm gonna use yet. So let me just open this in here. So this one is beautiful. This is a new one. This is the Kanaya Hotel in Nikko. I made a video unboxing this one as well, but I decided to to add this insert into this one because I used the other cover for something else. So moving on in here, this is my ink journal. So I just wanna select some that is gonna go with this one. This one already has some ink. This one has some ink and this one has some ink. So let's just select three different colors for these ones. So for this one, I just kinda wanna put that green in there since it's green. So let's just see which one match with that one. That I may want to use this month. This Vinta Carlos looks so pretty. I think I'm gonna use the Vinta Carlos and these ones is the ones that I have in here. So I would just have to find this one. So let me just find it in here and then I'm gonna show you the ink. This is the Vinta Carlos. I should put the names up here so it's easier to find them. But this is the one that I'm gonna be using. So this, I bought them this one in the Banis a pen shop. They have like so many of these small kind of like testers. And I really like this Vinta Carlos. So let's use the Vinta Carlos for this one. Then let's choose the ones for this two. So this one is gold, so you can put any color, but this one already has a brown in there. So let's see. Ooh, I really like this one. Hmm. Let's try to see. Yeah, I think I, for that one, I really like this brown in here. Or this honey. Yeah, this honey would look so pretty. Look, this honey in here. I think it's gonna look so nice with this one. So let's just find that one as well. Okay, this one took a lot more to like choose it and find it. So this is the honey, the key. WC honey and I'm gonna match that one with this pen. Then moving on into this last one is blue. So I'm gonna select a blue color in here. So I think the blues that I have are around here. So let's see which one. Um, I kind of like this one, the sketch Frieda or the Midnight. So we have the Midnight right here. But that one is kind of dark. It looks like blue, but at the same time it looks like really dark so let's see if i can find this cage brieda in here i think i'm gonna go with this one this one is a sketch frieda so i have it in here and it looks so pretty so let's just use this so let's just refill these ones in here so give me one second because this one i will need the needle to be able to refill it so i'm just gonna go find that real quick and come back Okay, so this is the one that I'm gonna be using. This has a needle and inside here, you just have a converter that I already washed down. So I can use it like this to put some of the ink inside. So I'm just gonna start doing that since I already chose the colors that I want. Let's just do the swatch in my journal. This journal in here that I have 
is the APEC and I have been doing currently ink. I didn't do in October because I had so many pens that already had ink, so I just used those. But November, I do really want to use new ones, mainly because I need, I got new fountain pens. So let's just move all this ink to the side and let's start doing this. So for this one in here is November. So the first one that we are gonna do this swatch is this one in here. This is the Vinta Carlos. So let's just open it up real quick. Let's use this dip pen to dip it in there. And let's just put it here. And that's how it looks, the Vinta Carlos. So I'm just gonna wash this in here. And then let's put this to the side. And let's open this and let's try to fill it up. So I'm just gonna take out some of this. And this is more than enough. And then I'm just gonna fill this up. Right there. And I'm gonna put that ink in there. So I fill out this. So now what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna close this really good in there. And then I'm gonna try. It's interesting how this moves a lot. I don't know why, but let's just try to do this. And let's try to close it to see if it works. This moves too much. I don't know why, but it works already. So for this one in here, we are using the Kaweco student. This is a EF size. I don't know if you guys can see the EF right there, but this is how it writes. It writes really nice, actually. I really like it because the other one that I got, I think I got it in like medium. The only thing is that this thing moves a lot, but I think I just have to adjust something. But so far it grinds nice. So that's the one I'm gonna be using. So that's the first ink. Let's just close this because we don't wanna make a big mess in here. So really tight in there. Then the next one is this one. This is the honey one and it's gonna be with this thing how. So this one, let's just do really quick in here the test so this is already clean let's open this and i'm doing all of this in october but it's actually november i kind of mess up in there but it's okay Ooh, i really like that one that looks really nice looks amazing looks really pretty it had to be in here, but it's okay. Oh my goodness, I love how it looks. That's so nice. Now let's do this. Let's try to do this. Let's take this out. Let's take this converter out. And let's put it in there to get some of the ink. I think that's enough of ink in there. So let's just close it in here. And let's do this. Hopefully it comes out real quick. Okay, so this one took a long time to come out. <laughs> I have a big mess in here. I had to close that uh, ink and put it there. But this one in here is the Jinghao. So I'm just gonna put it in here. Uh, I think this is a Jinghao 82. So this is supposed to be 
this is supposed to be you can see it barely writes it's supposed to be a fine nib i'm just gonna give it more time but this in here is to be honey in here so it's gonna be like really really bright color it, but yeah i think this needs to stay there for a while i already have everything in here i even have my wedding ring with all the ink i have to wa wash that down i should have taken that off but anyways let's finish this video so that one has the honey then moving on into the third one this one in here is the other jing hao so let's try to do this really quick in here so we can go wash my ring this one in here has this another converter that we are gonna take off and this one in here is the sketch Frieda, this color in here so let's just do this swash the other ones i'm not gonna do swashes i'm just gonna write with them because they are inks that i already tried out so let's just try to see this take some color in there Ooh, that grass really nice let's put that in there and let me show you how it looks it's really blue i don't know if you can see it in the camera it's really really nice and blue so i'm just gonna take this and I'm gonna insert this converter and try to make it work. The converter is really tiny, so it's kind of hard to put it in these kind of ink bottles, but I got it. So it, I'm just gonna close this and put it in here really quick. And I'm just gonna put this in here and hoping that this is gonna come quicker than the other Jing Hao one so let just try to see okay so this one came way way quicker than the other one this is the mini Jing Hao so as you can see in here the ink is coming in here which is okay I just have to make sure I clean up that but but I have so many fountain pens that I'm gonna use this one just for blue ink, so it's okay. But this one is the Mini Jing Hao. And I love how this one scribes. It grides so nice. Way better than this other one. I love how it grides, it's so nice. It looks so pretty. So this is the one that I'm gonna be using it looks so cute and my plan is because i'm gonna be traveling this month so i'm gonna put this because it's really tiny in one of the compartments um, of my travel bag and then i'm gonna put any of these other ones this one is the other one i have this one is the sailor one it already has ink inside and i'm just gonna keep using it with black because i love it i've been using it so much so you can see there is still ink coming out in there real quick but this is just a sailor sailor and i'm just gonna put white color in here because it already has ink and i love how it writes it writes really really smooth and nice so i'm gonna use that one this is how it writes and this is the ink that it has the other one is this one in here this one i absolutely love it this is the kaweko student and this one in here has a brown that is this brown red in here so i'm just gonna use the same one so this is again the Kaweko. A student with this red black color that if I'm not like wrong, this is the one that it has. It's the red black. This is the nudeless ink that has inside this one. So I love how this one writes as well. This one I think is a medium. Let me open it again. This one, oh no, this one is a EF as well. But at the same time, this is a EF and this one is a EF, but I don't know if you guys can see, but there is a big difference on how this one writes and how this one writes. This one is way slim and small, the, the thing that comes out of the nib, the ink, but this one is a little bit more ink. So it looks more like a medium or a fine tip. Then the last one is this one. I mentioned that I got this Pilot Vanishing Point. This one has black ink inside as well. So I'm just gonna write in there. And as you can see, this one is extra fine. And this is one of the most fine uh, pens that I own. Like even if they are all 
a EF in here. This one, look at how fine the like the letters are when I write with this one. This is still kind of like hard sometimes the ink to come, so I have to do this so many times in here so the ink can come naturally and better. But I just have to get used to this one. But yeah, so this comes really, really fine, the lines, which I really like. So that's all the things that I'm gonna be using for this month of November. Mainly, I'm gonna be traveling. So eh, I'm just gonna post the last one that is December in here. I'm gonna post it really, really by the end of December because I'm gonna come back in the middle of December. So basically this is gonna be like November, December kind of thing. And the ones that I'm gonna add for December is just a couple more for the end of the year. But I'm really excited to travel. I think I'm gonna take these ones to travel with me, these three to travel with me. And I'm gonna go to that trip, as I mentioned, in the end of this month. So I'm gonna be using these ones until then. But yeah, so these kind of videos are always really chaotic, eh, but I love watching other people using their own kind of inks and their own pens. And I love watching what other people are gonna use by the end of the year. But anyways, this is all for today's video. I know it was a little bit chaotic. I only used three inks and the other ones already has black ink and kind of like the brown ink in there. But I just didn't want to take out the ink and do replace that ink for anyone just because of a video. I just really wanted to use the ink that I already had inside. But yeah, that's all. These are all my beautiful selected babies of the month. And, and yeah. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you really like it. Please leave me a comment down there if you own any of these pens, which ones do you own, and what do you think of them? But that's all. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you in another video. Bye-bye.